Hi, I'm Shannon Lefevre with John Arwood Realtors. Many of you know me as Naples Smart Girl, and I'm here today to discuss what I've seen so far for the 2012 Naples real estate selling season. Um, we're just closing out our second month, and while there are some things that are kind of the same, there are a few things that are a little bit different, and I just kind of wanted to give you a heads up of what you could expect. As an example, our sales um, are really almost right neck and neck compared to where they were last year. And while some of you may view that as maybe not so great news, I think that's excellent news because last year we had a terrific year. So not too alarmed about that. A little bit more alarmed at the fact that our new listings are down about 4% compared to this time last year. That's not so great news because we are only averaging at about nine and a half months of of listing inventory right now, which tells me that Naples as a whole is in a little bit of an undersupply situation. We would like to see about 12 months of inventory, and right now we don't have it, and it doesn't appear like we're going to get it anytime soon either. So unfortunately, what I'm finding out is that many of my customers from up north that are coming down to take a look um, at property are not having the selection that they've had in the past several years. So you'll want to make sure that you do your homework in advance if you have the time to do it or give me a call and let me help you put a plan together so that when you get down here we can accomplish your real estate objective. There's a couple of other things going on that I think are worth pointing out. The fact that our pending sales are up 7% is extremely interesting to me because really contracts, contracts don't really start really flying around here until really March. While we do have January and February sales, don't get me wrong, I see a lot of paper fly in March and we're not there yet. So based off of what I've seen so far, I think that this year we're about three to maybe four weeks ahead of schedule compared to where we were last year. And what I mean by that specifically is last year what I found is that we had a lot of buyers come down who looked around and then they thought they could wait until the end of season and, and do some maybe deeper negotiations to find out that they actually lost their property to another buyer. This year what I'm seeing are people that are taking a peek at the internet, they're formulating their plan and they're getting back on right before they come down and they're finding that their properties that they had on their list to see are no longer available too. So this is almost a repeat of last year, just a few weeks earlier, if you will. The only other thing that I see as far as the t statistics are concerned is that we're averaging between 90 and 94% um, list price to sales price ratio. So you can expect to negotiate maybe around 10% off of your purchase price. For the most part, keep in mind that there's exceptions both directions all the time. So we'll want to get really detailed when you locate the property that you're interested in. But there's one location that is actually negotiating on an average of about 85%. That location is Port Royal. For whatever reason, there's, they're just a little bit more willing to negotiate with you compared to any of the other markets. So now might be a terrific time as a buyer to take a peek and see what's available down there because they're negotiating a little bit better there than they are any place else in town. Other than that, the only thing else that I want to point out is that Realtor.com reported just at the end of January that Naples is the number two most appreciating market in the country, coming in at about 21% um, compared to this time last year, which I think is actually quite alarming if you're a buyer, quite exhilarating if you're a seller. Let's not get too crazy regardless of who you are because we're still in a very uncertain market. While, while our numbers are good and, and we've got a lot of good news to talk about, I think that it's important that you contact a you know, solid professional who can help you with your pricing if you're a seller. And if you're a buyer, contact a professional who knows how to help you negotiate. I can't tell you how many times I'm involved in a transaction where there's really not a lot of negotiating going on. That's why you want to contact me to help you formulate a five-point negotiating strategy so that you can go and try to accomplish what it is you want to accomplish. If you have any other questions for me, I'm available almost 24 hours a day, but not quite. But you can always reach me via email at shannon at shannon.com or you can call me direct at 239-595-6223.
Of course, if I miss you, I'll certainly call you back as soon as I possibly can. And in the meantime, enjoy my website and my blog, and hopefully I'll get to meet and work with you soon. Have a great afternoon.